Well, how about varies, boys and girls? <laughs> oh, boy. I don't remember who said that. I don't remember when they said that either, but I remember somebody said that. How about that race, boys and girls? I don't remember that. I remember I remember somebody said that. I just don't remember who said that and when they said it. So, but boy, that was fucking awesome. Um, who said that? It's gonna be the bottom of hell. I mean, uh, I'm not thinking about this on camera. I do that too much, where I get my mind wanting to know something and then I think about it on camera. Anyway, fucking what a race! What a Kentucky. Can fucking Tucky. Can fucky. Yeah, can fucky. Wow. That was a great race. Um, never would have thought I would have said that about Kentucky. Besides 2013. That was the only good race at Kentucky. Um, and that was a day race. See, I'm glad, because I've always said, um, I'm always an advocate for night racing, but I've, I've said recently that I want K Kentucky to be a day race because the two times that this happened, 2013 for the Cup Series and 2017 for the Xfinity Series, They've been good races. Pretty much every other race has sucked. Um, I've been such an advocate for night racing, though. And the fact that we had a good race, and it was a night race at Kentucky, that's good. And I like Kentucky. I like Kentucky a lot. I don't like the racing product that usually comes out of it, but I actually like Kentucky. I like that it's a unique track. I, th I like the way it looks. Um, I think it's great, so... The fact that we were able to have a night race that was good is just, you know, amazing. And I kind of thought it would happen. Like, I thought we'd have a good race. I didn't, think we'd, I didn't think we'd have that good of a race. But, I mean, that was a great race. Um, the finish, it's bittersweet because, like, I was cheering at the end. And I don't like doing that when Kyle loses. Um, definitely if he finishes second. Well, I mean, I, I don't mind if Kyle, like, loses and it's just two other people battling for the win. But, like... Kyle lost that battle, and that just sucks, but, um, I mean, that's probably how it would have felt last year at Chicago. Well, no, probably, last year at Chicago, that probably would have been worse, because, um, I'm, I kind of want, I've wanted Curtis to win for a while now, and it's been almost a year, so, and for him to, people thought he was done, and I can see that, um, so to kind of see him dude he's done great things he probably should have like you know three or four wins at this point he should have kind of, almost should have won last week but didn't so i'm not complaining about last week though because i'm happy justin haley won that so yeah um johnson spun out in the race and yeah um he didn't even make contact with agano so yeah, it was just dumb shit happening. I think I think he got a little loose and then it's just too much. You can't really do anything at that at that speed in the corner, so then he just got in the wall. And that was pretty much it. Austin Dillon just missed a shift. Uh or he didn't miss a shift, but fourth he didn't have fourth gear. And that pretty much ended his race, and that sucks, because he was having a pretty good race at, up to that point. He was in the top ten. I think he got a few stage points, so. Uh, that's, not, that's not a damaged car, so he was able to go to the garage and get that fixed, so. Uh, but he, I think he finished, like, 30 laps down, so that sucks for him. Um, What else happened? What else fucking happened? Oh, the racing between... Oh, no. Chase Elliott... Chase Elliott had a flat tire. And that sucked. Um, but I think he came back to finish in the top 10. I'm not sure, though. And then... Th this is a race with a fight. I, I, I'm, not, I'm missing it right now. There's probably a fight going on. <laughs> no, I always... Th I miss fights. I like fights. Um, I, I wish it would happen more often. There's been many races over the last few years where I'm like, there's going to be a fight, and then there never is, so. Yeah, I like fights. Um, I should have streamed, and oh my god, I was going to stream this race. I was going to do a Watch with Sam, or probably not stream it, because you, YouTube would have a shit show, but I should have, like, done a Watch with Sam. So fucking pissed off that I didn't do it. Um, because that was a great race. I, I was assuming it was not going to be a great race. Yeah, I was like, it's not gonna be a good race at all. So, I'll probably, no, I probably won't do it next week at Loudon because that race is actually gonna suck. Probably do a, 
Probably do an, another watch with Sam at Watkins Glen. I'll probably do a few Red Sox games before then, too. Um, but that racing with Kyle Busch and Logano, honestly, Logano did nothing wrong. It was more frustrating, but, like, Logano didn't do anything wrong, so. Um, I thought he did. I was about, well, I mean, even if he did make contact with him, it's, he still didn't do anything wrong, but he did nothing to bitch about. I mean, there's a difference between, between him doing something wrong and him doing for fans something that for fans to bitch about, but he didn't even do anything for fans to bitch about, so. Um, it was, it looked like he made contact with him from an angle, but he didn't, so, uh, yeah. And then Bubba spun out with, like, six to go, so that brought up for the restart, and, um, what a great finish. What a great finish that was. But, yeah, what a great race. Um, best Kentucky race ever in any series. I know. Even the trucks. I actually didn't see the truck race. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna rate that race. Um, I'm gonna rate it 8.5. 8.5 out of 10. Oh boy. Uh, yeah, 8.5 out of 10. That seems like a pretty, pretty fair rating, if you ask me. Yeah. Um, Xfinity race. See, I watched. Is that why my cable's not working? That unplugged plug up there? I doubt it. I honestly doubt it. My cable box isn't working. I had to watch that race on the NBC app on my PlayStation. It's like, it's off by like two minutes. It's annoying as fuck. Um. But yeah. Extended race, I didn't, or no, I did watch that race. I did watch the race. I wasn't really paying attention though. I don't really remember much of what much of what happened. I know that Cole Custer won. That's pretty much it. But trust me, I did watch that race. Um, I I can't rate it because I didn't really pay attention. But yeah. Um, oh, Brandon Jones was leading for a while. I know that, and then I think something happened there. Um, and Christopher Bell. Yeah, I remember it was like a big long. Or no, I think Christopher Bell was like two seconds back. But then everybody else was like 15 seconds back. I think that's what happened. But yeah, Cole Custer got the win. Good for him. Um, in that big three, I'm, I'm honestly rooting for Chris Rommel. Just because he's the Toyota. I like that there's um, all three, all three uh, manufacturers in that. Because last year in the Cup Series big three, it was Ford, Toyota, Toyota. I like that there's a Ford, Chevy, and a Toyota. Um... Dodgers beat Red Sox. Oh, fucking boy. 11-2. to That's great. We beat their ass last night, so. World Series rematch. I'm, I'm the best two out of three is, is kind of what I'm hoping for. Um, yeah. So they're tied one and one. But yeah, what was I even saying? Oh, yeah. I like how there's one manufacturer... Or each of the manufacturers in that. Do they still have Dodgers in the Xfinity Series? I think they do. I think, like, only a few teams have them, and those teams suck. Or I know they did, like, after they left the Cup Series. But do they still have Dodgers in the Xfinity Series? Probably not anymore, but, like, I know they did after the Cup Series got rid of them. So, yeah. I think, like, Derek Cope or somebody irrelevant had it. Um, but yeah. Um, anyway, truck race. I didn't watch that. Um, but I know that Tyler Ankrum won. I don't know why he won or how he won. I just know that he did win. And I don't, I don't think it was very necessary, but first win. Um, that was three of the, three of the last four or at that point, three of the last four NASCAR races had a first-time winner at that point uh, because the Tyler Ankrum won that race, Justin Haley won Daytona, Ross Chastain, I actually thought it was the last four races, but then I remembered that Ross Chastain had that win at Las Vegas last year in the Xfinity Series, but yeah, Ross Chastain won Daytona, that was his second career win, and then Chicago for the Cup Series, Alex Bowman won that race, so yeah. 
That was cool. Cool stat. Cool stat, kid. Um, but yeah, pretty much all I got to talk about. Great race at Kentucky. New Hampshire's next. Probably going to suck. But yeah. I mean, New Hampshire's kind of similar to Phoenix. Well, not really, but like in the way, like it's classified, I think, the same as Phoenix. But yeah. And Phoenix sucked. Don't even give me shit. Phoenix sucked this year. The Ryan Blaney Kyle Bush battle. It was not it wasn't even a battle. It was Ryan Blaney slowly trying to catch up to Kyle Bush and then didn't. So yeah. Um that race sucked. I'm not even gonna fucking sugarcoat it. It sucked. Uh but yeah. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Bye.